A very good afternoon to everybody. I'm uh, Chef Amar from One World Hotel. We are a cinnamon restaurant. Today we are going to cook for you uh, fettuccine carbonara, whereby we are going to use uh, beef bacon. Uh, beef bacon actually it is halal. It is just only the name of the bacon that uh, it have a little bit of smoke flavor. So uh, the reason that I choose this dish, so at least uh, everybody at home can make use of it. And it is very simple and easy to prepare at home. I'll be switching on my pan. I'll make sure that the pan is hot. Putting some olive oil. Actually, I use a bigger pan because I'm going to give to some of my colleagues, friends around here. So I'm going to cook for them. So we wait for a while until the oil is hot. We are going to use fettuccine, spinach fettuccine, not the white one. So something different today. Okay, the oil is about. What I will do, I'll put some garlic. It's about two numbers. You see the technique in cooking uh, the spaghetti, you have to be careful how you handle your garlic. We have to be uh, really alert and keep eye on it all the time while we are doing it. Basically, it will take about two minutes. Depends on your uh, fire, how heaty it is. I won't make my fire too hot. I just make sure that the fire is gentle. We can say that now my garlic is uh, start turning to a golden brown color. Okay, I have to make sure that it is not really overcooked. Well, eventually you're not going to get everything even. So here and there, but basically 90% of your garlic is going to be brown color. We'll take the cream, at least around 400 to 500 ml. Okay. I'm taking my mushroom, very nice. Garlic and cream, they are really combined together. I'll be taking some pea bacon. This is, you can find it in any supermarket around Malaysia. So what I will do, I'll just stir. While I'm boiling it a little bit, I will take a little bit of parsley, around teaspoon. I like to have more parsley here. And I believe Malaysian people, they like it a little bit fiery. A little bit only, not so much. Black pepper and some Parmesan cheese, around two tablespoons for the first round, and we are going to finish it again with the second round. So what I will do while the cream sauce bubbling or simmering, I'll be putting my fettuccine, spinach. I'll be stirring it. I'll make sure that the fettuccine is all cooked through the sauce. The sauce now is a bit runny, is a bit watery. Don't worry about it. We are going to have it in the right consistency very soon. I'll make sure that my fire is a bit slow, not too hot. I wanted to make sure that the pasta infuses the sauce and the sauce infuses the pasta as well. Lastly, what I will do, I will take my salt and I'll put inside. Make sure you don't put too much salt because the bacon itself is already salty. So I can see now my sauce is reducing a little bit. I will add a little bit of stock. Then I will take two egg yolks and I will stir them. And that's it. So, taking the plate. You see, once you add the egg yolk, you have to make sure that you cook it very fast in less than 10 seconds. You just only make sure that you stir the egg yolks with the pasta with the cream. You can garnish it either by whatever garnishing you have at home. So I just only use this time. I'll take a little bit of my Parmesan. I just only sprinkle the top. And a small dash of lovely, healthy, extra virgin olive oil. And voila, finished fettuccine, carbonara.